Come on, man. We've been knocking doors all day long. Let's quit for the night. We don't quit until we're done. Well, then let us be done for the night. You haven't made enough sales to go home. Loveland, we are in the middle of nowhere. That's Mr. Loveland to you, my wet noodle pupil. I know this. Suzette. Yes. Are we in the middle of nowhere? Yes. Hey, wouldn't you have to be a psycho to knock on doors this deep into the country? Yes. <laughs> so doesn't that mean that this whole area is untouched? Hmm? Virgin? Dude! What? Bro. Listen, Ramen. Only psychos go down seasonal roads. And only psychos are crazy successful. Are you trying to imply that all that's required to succeed is to drive down a seasonal road? You got damn right. Now, I wouldn't pretend to know everything, but gosh damn it, when it comes to door to door sales. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Are you saying, got damn it? <laughs> well, gosh damn it, Ramen House, would you want me to say it? I'm pretty sure it's goddamn. <laughs> Does that bring that blaspheme banter back? Oh, what are you angry at some words, Snowflake? Uh, what, uh, that PC poppycock? Guys, you just gotta listen to me when I say, oh shit, a cat! <laughs> Got it! What the, what the fuck? fuck? <laughs> you butter biscuit bitches, I wouldn't hit a oopsie woopsie teeny tiny titty tat. Fuck this, I vote we go home! Other than a sign from Got himself. Or herself. Eh, doubt it. Other than a sign from Got themselves, we are going to find another door to knock. I think that would qualify as a sign from Got? Ramen, you observant beast. I think you could be right. I think we should follow it into the woods. Two for two, Ramen, my boy. Don't I get a vote here? Now it is 2023. Yeah. Of course you get a vote. Yeah. Who wants to chase the scary light into the woods? Oh, I do, I do, Ooh, I me, do. Me, Oh, sorry, oh. Suzette. That's two to one. Men are such idiots. Hey, don't stereotype all men. Mm. Oh, you're right. You two are such idiots. That's better. Oh, shit. I'd like to think that the 15 or so books that I've read on tracking have led us here. What books have you read on tracking? The classics, you know. Where's Waldo? I Spy. Bro, you didn't lead us here. As a matter of fact, you were so scared you kept asking to hold my hand. Damn it, Ramen. Th that was for your own protection, and you know it. What is this thing? <laughs> Apparently you've never seen a space rock before. <laughs> Where'd you get that science, Curious George? <laughs> Actually, I just read the Flat Earth Guide to the entire globe. Hmm? You plot poles. We just discovered a fucking space rock and all you can do is squabble. Squabble, squabble! You think we should touch it? I think maybe you should touch it. Wait, Ramen. You are now off the clock. Whatever happens, you can't hold me or my company responsible. We don't even clock in. You only pay us commission. I get paid hourly plus commission. What the fuck, Loveland? Damn it, Ramen. Touch the stupid space rock. <laughs> Guys. It was beautiful. What was beautiful? The space rock. It showed me. Showed you what? The way. It showed me the way. How to become the perfect salesperson. Guys, we've been doing it all wrong. The secret to sales is fairness. Integrity. What? And honesty. You wait right there, pal. I won't sit by idly and listen to you slander the good name of sales. You don't have to be afraid, Mr. Loveland. 
Well, there's no way I'm gonna let you have some sort of edge on me, so. Wait! Well? Honesty is the best policy. No! Relax, Loveland. This is only gonna make us more money. Listen here, lady gal. The only thing that makes it rain motherfucking money is cutting off the balls or the ovaries of all of your enemies. Mom. What was that? The truth. No, no, no. Listen. Mm. Oh. Yeah. oh my Lanta. He is so adorable. Adorable? More like, um... You know what? Never mind. Besides, this could be an, an illegal alien. Bro. Oh, not this shit again. You can't call an otherworldly being an illegal A-L-I-E-N. Try to tell you, man. Time and place, guys. This thing is clearly a threat. Aww. Aww. Damn it, children. Hey there, little fella. Feels like beautiful, positive energy. I mean, what do we do? Do we kill it? Do we? Uh... Whoa! Uh, no, we don't kill the cute little alien, otherworldly creature. Stay as woke as you want, but we can make a lot of money, money by selling this creature on the black market. Wait, Suzette, is he allowed to say black market? I wouldn't risk it. Mm. Well, what do you guys suppose we do with it? I think he wants to come with us. Listen, any creature that's telling you to be honest is lying. Listen, man, come morning, you'll see. This is the new code. We're going to make good money and be good people. I hate all of you. Y'all excited for another day of door-to-door -door swindling? Okay, I think we're gonna hold on the swindling this time. The little guy brings us new strategies. The little guy? Where's the little guy? The little guy? How am I supposed to know? Well, I figured you're the one that took him. Okay, I did not take the little guy. He came with me. The little guy? Yeah, but I figured you'd at least keep him till the morning. Keep him? Oh, hell no, Raman. You can't just find and take creatures. What, the little guy's just my prisoner now? The little guy? Yes! The otherworldly creature that we found last night. That we met last Ugh. night. Wait, that little rabble rouser was real? What? Yes. Damn it, Robin, I, I thought it was a dream. A dream? Didn't you get my text last night? <laughs> Honestly, Suzette, I have you on mute. Wow. If only I could get you to mute in person. You mother... Here we are. <laughs> you got the little guy stoned? Ether five on it. Enough of this verbal vomit. Suzette, go make me some motherfucking money. That's fine, but I'm gonna do it in a positive way. My name is Suzette from Sierra, and I would like to show you a mediocre product at a top of the line price. That sounds fantastic. Please tell me more. So what do you think? Are you willing to listen to a two hour sales pitch about air purifiers with a high pressure close at the end? That sounds fantastic. Please come on in. Thank you so much. I'll just need you to open a window so we can clear the air before we get started. What the hell?
<laughs> Great job, Suzette. Well, we're definitely ranking in the Wazillions, but I'm still a little suspicious about this whole honesty thing. It's all about the dollars, Mr. Loveland. Whoop, whoop. Can you watch where you're walking? Chill, Suze. It's Suzette, asshole. Listen, I'll call you whatever you want if you can get a damn contract right. What are you talking about? What did I miss? You wrote the interest is $24.99. Ha, <laughs> rookie. <laughs> you know we charge the not so legal limit of 65.32. Hey, suck my squirrel nuts, okay? Children, please. You've been selling like mad people all week. I'll take care of the contract and you two go make me some motherfucking money. Now, shoot, shoot, get, get, go. Come on. Get on, little doggies. Huh? <laughs> and a stranger than fiction twist that has not been seen in this county since the Great Possum Fire of 76. There seems to have been a string of killing in Sales County so terrifying, so graphic, and so mysterious that it has left our law enforcement in complete disarray. The DNA left behind in the victim's wounds are believed to not match any known DNA on the planet Earth. The images we are about to show you are disturbing, and we ask that anyone with... Hello? Hello? Knock, knock. Miss Johnsonson? Uh, just made an adjustment to the contract. Uh, needed to get an initial. Miss Johnsonson? <sighs> get back here, you little monkey fuck. Um, Ms. Johnsonson, are you okay? We'll get you the help you need, ma'am. But first, I gotta teach this little extra testicle sales poo nanny what a hard close really is. Let's dance. My name's Suzette from Sierra, and I would like to show you a mediocre product at a top-of-the-line price. That sounds stupid. You're an idiot. What the hell? I don't know, homie. I've had the last 12 doors slammed in my face. Me too, and I've been saying the same thing I've said all day. I don't know. Maybe this honesty stuff really isn't paying off. I wonder where little guy is. Mm, either way, I think we should get back to Loveland. I have a weird feeling. A uh, woman's intuition? People's intuition. It's fucking non-stop with you, isn't it? Okay, I've had about enough of you. Aha! Got your corner now, you little two-eyed freak. Now come on out. <laughs> I know you're in there because nothing. And I mean nothing gets past the keen eye of Mr. Motherfucking Lovely. Nibble in my neck. 
neck, huh? You creep. You're just lucky there's no major arteries in the neck. Ooh, yikes. You sick bastard! We saved you from a space rock, and this is how you repay us? Teach my team honesty and try to eat my face? Honesty is not the best policy. <laughs> Loveland, you here? Oh my god, Loveland, are you okay? I'm fine. Mostly. Oh my god, the customer! Don't worry, Ramen, my boy. We can just forge your signature on the contracts. Sounds good to me. Are you sure, Suzette? Wouldn't be very honest of us. Because you know what I've learned today? Life isn't about honesty, it's about getting what you want. And if that requires telling the truth, telling a little white lie, or forging the signature of a dead woman so you can make 200 bucks, it doesn't matter. Because at the end of the day, all that really matters is... Such bullshit. Do you think the little guy had us opening up the windows because he didn't like know how to use doorknobs or something? Probably. Sorry to kill your pet slash friend otherworldly creature. Oh, don't be. He's kind of a dick anyway. Yeah, he ate all my peanut butter. Yeah. Actually, that was me. No, I mean at my house. Yeah, I know. You gave me a key. No, I didn't. Yeah, I know, but you used that stupid key rock and I found it and let myself in. Well, I appreciate you being honest about it. Gross. <laughs> 